I have two new full size perfumes. I am in Pune. Hi you guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. If you're on my channel, I'm Akanksha. So uh, you can see I'm all decked up. I am in Bombay actually. Um, I did not film like the process to come to Bombay but I'm already here and I'm also already dressed uh, because first I have two events tonight uh, one is the uh, Estee Lauder company's Christmas party so first I'm going there it's in BKC and then I have another one which is in Hungary which is my uh, agency chatterbox anniversary party so this uh, is what I'm wearing all black and gold very classy very like OG and uh, yeah after Bombay this time I'm even going Mahabaleshwar so I thought I'll like vlog everything so yeah let's go to Elka company this is the, actually the first time I'm actually going to their uh, um, office and I actually don't know anybody who's invited or like I don't know if anybody I know is going to come or not but uh, let's go let's I have jolly five. Oh. On one ticket or two tickets? Oh, sorry. Sorry, no, sorry, no. One ticket. One ticket. Nobody listened to me. Got it. Got it. The next, the next ball score means you've got to sing a song or something. <laughs> okay, I'm the first one. It's fine. I just woke up I have to check out from this hotel and go for lunch and then in the evening I will be going to Mahabaleshwar I wanted to go to Mahabaleshwar ever since I was in Pune like from 2015 to 19 I was in college and I always wanted to go but it just never worked out and I'm this time I, like when I did you know got to know that I'm coming to Bombay I was like might as well do it because it's nice winter also it's going to be very cold it's strawberry season which I'm super excited for as well but yeah last night was so much fun like um, all creators together with like I did come from Naikaland but Naikaland was like work work for everybody and we could not meet everybody in, like and chill in a sense so yesterday was so much fun first like Estee Lauder event uh, uh, and then I went to the chatter party chatter party like it was so much fun I danced so after a very long time I feel I've not been partying lately at all uh, so I got home late little not home hotel late last night I just woke up and I just opened all the goodies Estee has given me let me show you they gave so many goodies I my heart is so happy this is like this moisturizer whenever I get in PR I'm like thank you god but literally look at it like it's literally a 20,000 package and it is so cute um I love working with Elka as a like you know all the brands like I love Jo Malone Estee Lauder I've worked with so much Ordinary my favorite favorite Smashbox Mac OG makeup like Clinique for skincare like all day every day this one I have to try I've not tried this yet and this also I've not tried but look at it so luxe like the packaging everything is so great and the agency that works with Elka also is very nice to me they were the ones who actually got me um what do you say like the chance to make a video with Deepika as well 
so yeah it was fun meeting them they actually did that party um christmas party type it was yesterday and they've not done that since covid and this is the first time they uh, did it like after covid and there were actually very few people it was very exclusive when there was just hardly like 10 to 15 influencers um so i'm very glad like my time synced with the event um you know while i'm in bombay so and i went it was super cute to meet like every all the elka team the priyapan team so yeah now i just have to start packing get ready and go i have two new full size perfumes i have to try them yet but like i love the packaging of perfumes they're like so luxe i mean it they just make my heart so happy like the irrespective of the smell like look at how pretty they look Okay, you guys. Day one in Mahabaleshwar. Last night, I took a bus from Mumbai to Mahabaleshwar, and um, it took a quite a long time. Actually, got into the bus at ten thirty, and I got down at like seven thirty. Two fifty kilometers, seven hours was like a really long journey. Um, but yeah, came here in the morning. Um, the room was not ready, obviously, because I came very early. Had breakfast, checked into the room, and. Uh, Since morning I had some work, so I couldn't go out. But now it's four thirty, so I thought at least I'll go see some sunset points or some dam. I can see like a, a dam or a lake. I'm not sure from my room, and the view is really pretty. So I'm going to go there and um, then go strawberry plucking because it's the season. So yeah, let's go. I'll let me show you my outfit. Abba, my hair though looks crazy. There's this movie called Anjali. I look like I'm <laughs> with a cardigan, the shoes, the hair. I look like a little kid, but um, love the hair and look at the view. Wow, beautiful! My the room is actually very messy for me to show right now, so I will clean this a little later and show it to you. But let me show you the view. So just ate food, so there's a lot of food there, but. Imagine I can see all this from my bed, from the room, from the chair. Now it is a little dry and all there, but I think in monsoon this would be even more prettier because it will be completely green. It is a little cold, like full winter feels. I was like blue, icy, spicy. Right outside the room is this cute little garden. So calm and peaceful here, except for that kid shouting. <laughs> Parsi point. Don't ask me why it is called Parsi point. You can see the same view from the room also. So Sydney point. It's a sunset point. Oh my god. I think this. Damn good throughout. You can see. You don't have to go to Australia. You can see it here. Want to go to Sydney? Come to Mahabali. Mutgar. Ila te pude gunde ride jis ko hari. This point. Sydney point. Sunset point. It is super, super beautiful. It's very pretty. You can see the clouds are like coming out right now. It's extremely beautiful. So I'm at the sunset point at a place called Table Land. It's called Table Land because it's like super flat, even on like the highest like point. So and it's very, very crowded today because I feel like I think students are on excursion here, and um, yeah, very crowded. But uh, look at the view. Super great. See. You have to get on horses here, but um, we I do not because I don't want to. The monkeys here. There's so many instructions when you 
go to monkey forest in Bali. So I know all what to do when I'm with them. So I'm like, I'm not interacting with them. I'm just enjoying the view because it's super beautiful. Okay, I just got to my room and it is so cozy. Like, look at the view. The camera is not doing justice, but it's just so cozy, so nice inside. I love it. It is day two. I just took bath and I'm going to have breakfast. Today, I'm going to go to the temple and all. Um, so, I'm very excited. I wanted to go to the temple for so long and look at the breakfast with a view. This is like a sandwich. I think I will like this one. Strawberry season. season. There are so many strawberries. Okay, first stop was at the mini chiki shop because chiki and everything is very famous. Tasted different different types of it, but uh, I only like the traditional chiki, so I bought that and I bought the strawberry one and we, I bought a little bit of chana. Now next on to Mapro Garden, it's basically like a factory with, I don't know what, let's find out. One, of, one person online was like, you have to go there, have their strawberry churned ice cream and all. So I just entered. Strawberry cream with ice cream. I tried this at the other place last night. Uh, I don't remember what was that color. It's same strawberry, but then it's was for strawberry cream with ice. With strawberry with cream, this is strawberry cream with ice cream. That was very okay -ish for me. I don't like it that much. So let's see how. It's great when you get ice cream in it. Without the ice cream, it's just cream. Cream. So this definitely is much better because there's that sweetness 
of ice cream, the cool, the cool, like the bomb. We are at another strawberry farm. Yesterday we went to one, but we didn't find any strawberries there. So apparently they tell November and December is like a season, but they plant in uh, October. So usually, like plucking, like you want to go pluck strawberries by yourself, it's usually in Feb and March. So now you can just see and buy if you want. So this is how the plantations are. Throughout the season of 7-8 months of its survival, it gives around a 1 kg strawberries. This one tree. Hey, there's something inside this. Okay, next stop. Uh, there are four points here. I'm not sure what the names are but like we just walked in and uh, I'm going to show you something the view re it looks really nice it's full sunny but it's really pretty look at that we walk further ahead from there then here's the elephant point because it elephant stone point because it's shaped like a trunk of the elephant this is the valley <laughs> okay yesterday um we went to one farm and there they said we cannot pluck or anything and i was really sad because i was very excited too so we found a farm right next to our hotel uh, which we went on the first day so here are a lot of things to do and i can pluck like one kg for 400 rupees so i'm trying to there are a lot of them actually i think i can uh, start plucking but if we i feel like did not grow fully no That day when I show the room, it was very messy, but now I'm checking out. So here's like a final tour of the room. This view is really beautiful. The hotel, by the way, is called Hotel Miraya. The hotel is called Hotel Miraya. It was 9,500 for two days. The food is actually really good as well. Um, I ate breakfast, lunch, dinner all here only, and the food is actually really nice. And um, yeah, pretty neat, pretty you know beautiful comfortable location is also great everything is great so let's go this is the washroom <laughs> okay you guys so i am in pune i have uh, my return flight flight from pune so in the morning I started and I came off and uh, I just went to my friend Nishi stays in uh, Pune now so I went put my luggage there I'm going out to have lunch so if you don't know I was in Pune for four years during my engineering so it's a very very close city uh, for me I love the city so much and it's been four years that I came here though because uh, 2019 I passed out and then I came for convocation in December 2019 and then covid happened and all and then i just never got the chance to come and i finally here and but i only have like a few hours before i get my next flight um so i'm just going to one of my favorite places which is in balewadi it's called urban foundry i'm not sure if the food etc is still the same but back then we used to get like um you know one liter beer for like 500 rupees or something and then we used to get this very yummy pizza so it's lunchtime anyway so i thought i'll go there my friend is driving and um, yeah full feels like i'm going on scooty like for four years in college i used to live in flat for like two years i used to go college room all these areas in like scooty only so um, it's a extreme nostalgic feeling for me right now and it also has changed a lot uh, nishi when i was when i told her i'm coming she's like Shock Pune ka. 
and she's like I'm really uh, that's why I'm waiting to see Balewadi because that part has also changed a lot my street so yeah let's go I used to buy all my groceries here I used to eat we used to eat uh, under Maggie in the night no no not here under Maggie places there we used to buy groceries all here one of my friends used to stay inside this society cool yeah, after coming partying, which that place used to be on till like three, four o'clock in the morning. So I used to do all that. Rohan Leher, see that building name was Rohan Leher, that other building. There my friends used to stay. Full extreme nostalgic feeling and everything. <laughs> this road is Pancard Road. My gym used to be here, which I paid for never went. I think it's in that building. Construction happening above that is urban foundry. This and all was not there only four years back. See still there. Ho garden brought 500 ml, 500 rupees. This is the pizza, makhan wala pizza. Without any extra toppings. It is like butter. Makhan wala matla butter. It makes in your mouth. Chupa chupi khel rahi hai. Don't. Don't. 